Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 3rd of May 1978, the first spam email was sent by Gary Thurk of Digital Equipment Corporation of Maynard, Massachusetts. Digital Equipment Corporation was an early computer manufacturer that, by the late 1970s, was beginning to challenge market leader IBM. Based on the East Coast, DEC sought to expand its customer base further west by inviting potential customers to a demonstration of their forthcoming DEC 20 and TOPS 20 operating system. The company was excited to showcase its incorporation of the ARPANET protocol, one of the precursors to the modern-day internet, into their new product. Gary Thurk was the marketing executive for Digital Equipment Corporation who decided to advertise the new product using ARPANET itself. Having obtained a printed copy of ARPANET email addresses, Thurk instructed engineer Carl Gartley to add all the West Coast addresses as recipients for a single email shot. So many addresses were added that some even overflowed into the message body itself. The email was sent from Thurk's account at 12.33 Eastern Time on the 3rd of May 1978 to almost 400 recipients. The message garnered a number of complaints from people who felt the system should not be used for unsolicited bulk mailings, including from the United States Department of Defense Communications Agency. Despite the negative response, Thurk later revealed that around 40 people came to the demonstrations that the email was advertising. He estimated that this then led to more than $12 million in sales, further highlighting the effectiveness of his approach. Nevertheless, a few days after the email message was sent, Thurk's boss asked him to promise never to do it again. <laughs> 